direction he's gonna go. Mooney can't get down on the front end. J.B. Mooney shows us all again not only how good he is, but right there how tough he is. The 32-year-old always loves to prove the naysayers wrong, and that score, 84 and a half, is enough to move him to the number one spot. Wow. <laughs> and that's really all you need to say. Just wow. Wow. <laughs> I, I'm speechless. I mean, at the fact that he's just able to get up and walk off because this bull literally just pounds his head into the ground, but he's just making Hail Mary moves. And I hope they don't look at it back to see if his free hand ever touched that bull or himself because it was close a few times. But man, Mooney hits the ground hard. But can't. You cannot by no way means ever doubt JB's effort in bull riding. So I think uh, he's got some redemption on his mind. He gets the redemption he was looking for, but he he's takes out, guys. a horrible hit. You heard Jesse say that Silvano was dazed and he is still feeling the effects. He's going to get that qualified ride, but after sports medicine checks him out, we're all going to wonder whether he can come back for a championship round. And the score is going to be low, 84 and three quarters, but you got to give him credit for making the eight. I liked it a little better than 84 yeah. and three quarters. Bull really had a pretty decent day when he goes back. Watch how he just lands right on that point of that shoulder and side of his head right here. That's, that's a light switch to some guys, bam, right oh. there. Number two, unsuccessful. Can number one extend his lead? Better get down. Nope. Oh, oh. And scary oh. situation there for Jose. Compromising situation. And now we see Jose holding on to that free arm wow. in pain. He just gets lift that arm behind him. Ever jump, he didn't get it back to front fast enough. His foot hangs a lot like Luciano, and just you talking about a game of inches, yeah. J Dub, we've seen that happen several times tonight, where that spur gets caught in the bull rope, and it leads to a devastating dismount. Crazy in a bull that's bucked him off three times before. It's crazy. This one should not buck him off, and he's gonna get him again. And oh man, and a parasito down and you can see slow to move bull riders you saw silvano alves our sports medicine team down there quickly to tend to eduardo scary situation here As again, we are reminded of the dangers of this sport. And watching the body language of those that are around Eduardo right now, Jade, a good indication. It looks as if though, yeah, he, it's hard he's to see, up. but he's, it looks as if though he's setting up, which we know is a good early indication. There you see the rest of our sports medicine team in from tending to other athletes from the back. Going out, I can, I, the way it looked like, I like to watch it back before I really speak, but it, all, it almost looked like he was, he's knocked just so close to being out. And I've been there, you're like, you're not there, but you, you, lights are on, nobody's home type deal. Well, the good news and is, I he's mean, gonna... you're trying to get up and there, you can't do nothing. You're just paralyzed almost. And you think you're getting up and going places, but you ain't doing nothing. Hey, Zeus, he's aboard short pop. Wow. And short. Oh, I don't pop. like that. 
making quick work of Cody Jesus. And you can see. I didn't see him get him nowhere. Uh, and, and I know that Cody Webster's right there. Webster, I can see you looking back at the big screen. We're watching it here on the replay as well. Did you see what happened there, Cody? Man, man, I tell you what, he's uh, he's in a lot of pain right there, but that's, he said it's just growing. Uh, not, a, not a good injury for a bull rider. Hunter Bird with his shot. It's against a very good bull after midnight. Yeah, this is one that could fit Tanner. This bull can get pretty steep. Sometimes he tries to turn back a little too close, but where Tanner really likes to pull his knees up and use them, this bull could play right into that kind of a riding style. Saw this bullet iron cowboy, Cody Jesus, bucked off in just over two seconds. You got to go all the way back to Iron Cowboy of 2018, the last time this bull was ridden. That was Ramon De Lima, who is no longer on tour. Hey! After midnight, able to fast forward the clock against Tanner Byrne, no chance at all. Byrne looks to be banged up, and he's got Chase Outlaw right there to lend a helping hand. Yeah, you could see Byrne kind of holding his riding hand as he got out of the arena there. And you can't ride him with any hands. This bull really throws a lot of power at him and jerks the bull rope out of his hand. And Tanner Byrne is hurting right now. Some fast buck offs in our championship round, but some high drama about to unfold as we watch Tanner Byrne exit the building.